Why did the bike fall over? Why? It was too tired. Oh. You know, just a classic dad joke to get my nerves down. <laughs> Research shows in seven seconds into my speech, you'll decide whether you like me or not. And in 30 seconds, you'll decide if you keep listening to me or not. I mean, considering we're 30 seconds in, I hope, I hope you're enjoying me. <laughs> For those who do not know me, I'm Adam Chaikin, and I'm running for student body vice president. I would like to thank Dr. K, Mrs. Bronick, and the senior class senators for giving me this opportunity. I'd also like to thank Delaney for being a great opponent and friend. I cannot respect her more. I always get asked one question when people hear I'm, I am in Senate. They always ask, what does Senate actually do? <laughs> I, really could, I could really go on listing all the discussions that take place, counting the amount of hours we spent planning events such as homecoming, power week, and prom, and explaining the way we fundraise for our class and community. However, I think the most important job is to re represent our diverse student body. Sorry, moving papers, guys. It is because of all the things we do and represent in Senate that I want to become your student body vice president. Community service falls directly under the role of student body vice president. I'm very passionate about the community, I'm very passionate about the community service, sorry, and actively volunteer for many causes such as Special Olympics, Bags of Fun, Lunchbox Express, and There With Care. This has provided me with a, with a solid foundation to both understand the importance of the, and of, the importance of, and value in, community service, and it is something that I've grown quite passionate about. No matter the time or place, one thing always holds true. The joy and smiles I receive from giving back to people in the community always makes me excited for the next chance I get to volunteer. Throughout the last couple of years, the opportunities I've had to meet with many student groups have been amazing because of the new knowledge and perspective I have gained. Through building these relationships, I've been inspired to be a voice that helps implement the change and be a resource of insight and foster connections with my platform in Senate. Freshman year at this time, I would have never imagined meeting so many new people and gaining such an insightful perspective for the diversity and culture at Crete. Collaborating and watching this year's exec members, I'm excited to carry on traditions and make new ones as a Creek leader. I'm extremely motivated to continue building the foundation of previous student body vice presidents, just as my sister did about 10 years ago to the day. Though I still can't find her handprint on the wall. <laughs> I, God. But more importantly, I will evolve the role of vice president with my unique perspective and experiences in the CCHS community. I want to lead conversations on topics I see and hear and be a leader in providing a solution to important topics. One of my greatest strengths is connecting individually with many groups of people and learning about people's interests and goals and how Senate can help make them a reality. As student boss, uh, oh my gosh, as student, vi a student vice, oh my gosh, as student body vice president, there it is, I know I can better the Bruin family as a leader within Senate and as a voice for my peers. I enjoy collaborating with others and I'm of course excited to work on projects with within Senate, and I'm also excited to collaborate on initiatives outside of our organization with students from Spectrum, BSU, NHS, and much more this upcoming year. I'm so motivated by my classmates and all the opportunities in the Creek community, and I'll keep going above and beyond to make sure the Bruin family can be the best it can be. While VP, of course, has its sets of responsibilities to uphold, it is also about supporting the president and stepping up to the plate when needed. If this year has taught me anything, it is the ability to improvise. I've learned that improvising means working through all the means possible to be successful. Senate is giving me the opportunity to not only build leadership and networking skills both in and outside the classroom, but more importantly, give me insight to the bigger picture of figuring out what life throws at me. And while I may not always have everything figured out, it's about staying cool, calm, and collected while collaborating with my peers to find the best path forward. As a soccer goalkeeper, I'm responsible for leading and managing the players throughout the game, making sure we stay consistent and being a quick thinking, reliable leader in times of pressure and need. 
I can implement a change quickly and improvise if the game is not going to plan. Through mock trial, we're always looking for new members, by the way, <laughs> quick shout out. I have learned to manage my team and grow a club from the ground up. S skills such as constant communication, keeping club members motivated, and holding everyone accountable is critical. These, experience directly, these experiences directly apply to everything required of the student body vice president. It is my objective to help bridge the gap between, between our work in Senate and other students so we can help make a real impact on such important topics. Not only do I gain a sense of joy from speaking to my peers on behalf of Senate, but I understand the strong need for leaders to help more initiatives like this move forward. I know I'm the right person to continue these efforts as student body vice president next year, and I'm so grateful for this opportunity. Thank you. That's interesting. So I think, um, yeah, quick, big time, quick speaker. Um, I think this year, well, we had lots of issues with 3v3 basketball, and I think the biggest problem that we had to do was improvise and try and find a new plan. So what we ended up doing is going to Dr. K, and I don't know how many times we went to her, asking about new ideas and new ideas, but the only thing we wanted is to make an event work for Power Week. We wanted to fundraise the best we can. I mean, as Minecraft maybe didn't turn out as well as we hoped it to, too, but I think that it was still something that was beneficial for the Power Week. It really helped. So I think it's just the ability to adapt and move on and create new plans. Um, what is one thing you plan to do as vice president to contribute to the Creek community as a whole, especially through the community service committee? Yeah. So. Um, I, I mentioned a lot of this in my speech, so sorry to be repetitive, but I think, I think being vice president or anyone on exec board is about bridging the gap between us and the students. And if you can't talk to your peers and find out their interests and what they want to happen to make a reality or what we can make a reality, it's pointless. So I think that with community service, it's finding out what, what groups need help first and foremost, then working with them to make it a reality. I mean, Bags of fat, Fun, Bags of Fun is an awesome example. Um, we, we have students in Creek who need those bags and we do that every year. It's, there, there you go. <laughs>